Hey you guys, welcome back. Today I'm showing you what our master bedroom is looking like right now. As you all know, if you have been watching, I recently was repainting my bedroom, at least some of the walls, and I got a new desk because as I'm doing YouTube, I am discovering that it would be really nice to have an actual desk to kind of put my stuff on. So I am just going to show you guys how I kind of carved out a little corner in our bedroom and yeah, I'm super excited about it. I hope you guys enjoy it. So let's just get right into it. So this is what the room looks like just when you come in the door as a lot of you are familiar with, but um, this is the corner I redid. I used to have a chair here in the corner, but I saw the need of having an actual desk for my like my YouTube stuff especially and so I had my uncle make me this desk. I had seen something like this similar on World Market. I saw it on Pinterest but I don't think they sell it anymore and so this thing is pretty similar to what they used to make or what they used to sell uh, but basically he just used some white oak and then I had my dad uh, finish the top of it and then he just used metal for the legs and I really like it. Um, the top could have maybe been a little darker and I also had had him make a coffee table. He wanted to do that and so I'm still working on the coffee table top because it was this color but I'm going to make it darker. However, I really like uh, how it looks in here. I think it works with the white. So I'm just going to leave this and yeah, I have really been enjoying this space. Um, as you all know, I painted the walls white. They used to be uh, gray like these stripes over here but I eliminated the gray on the three other walls. I did not paint these walls. I just decided to leave them because I didn't want to have to deal with uh, stripes. <laughs> so um, I love what it did to the room. It's just nice and fresh and white. And so yeah, this is this corner is really one of my favorites. And I have certainly been using this corner a lot already. I picked up this chair at like one of those surplus stores. I had seen it on Facebook Marketplace. I had uh, seen some things advertised and so mom and my sister and I went to check it out one day and um, yeah, I really I really like it. It was only $50 so I thought it fit into my budget. Um, might not be for long term but for now it works. And then I just got this picture from Hobby Lobby. I know a lot of you probably have that or have seen it and yeah, I like I like this sign. I thought it would fit well in the bedroom and I just have a basket there in the corner with a blanket that I use a lot and a pillow and stuff. So and then also I wanted to mention this light if you saw this in a, my other video I've done I talked about it. Um, I was sent this light from a company on Amazon I think they're called Bright Tech or something. I had picked this one out and it's like obviously as you saw it's a touch lamp uh, here. It has three different kinds and it's like an LED light and so far I'm really loving it. It's just slim and it fits into the space nicely and I can adjust the brightness and yeah I really like it. And also I wanted to mention that they have a discount code for you guys. I think it's like a 10% off or something and I will be sure and link that all in the description box if you are wanting some. They have a lot of other lamps and lights and I think possibly some other stuff as well. So be sure and go check them out and thank you especially to Bright Tech for giving me that. As far as the decor, I was kind of trying to go for like a bohemian vibe I guess as you can kind of tell but this style is really um, something I enjoy and the rest of my house is not necessarily like this as much but um, I decided maybe I can pull it off in my bedroom at least because <laughs> obviously I can't go buy everything new in my whole house. So for now, I think I'm kind of getting it done in my bedroom at least. And then this macrame um, hanger is from Five Below. I actually was gifted to me at Christmas. We had played a game and this was one of the prizes I had picked. But it was from Five Below and they have similar things. I don't think they have the same one anymore. But, uh, and then up here I have this hanger thing from um, Ikea. The basket part is from Ikea and then the plant I've managed to keep alive from last year and I just have it hanging from the ceiling and I have this copper um, plant with a faux succulent in here for right now. I had picked up um, the little plant hanger at Five Below the other day so kind of have a theme going here I guess but I don't know what do you guys think is that too much plant stuff going on? <laughs> uh, this 
um, little faux fiddly fig I had gotten last year at Kirkland, so this is not new. And then I just, as far as my organization goes, I have this little cleaned out candle uh, that I'd gotten at Target. It used to be a candle, so I have my headphones in there. And this little box I picked up at TJ Maxx here recently. If you saw in a haul I did, and then I just have some of the essentials that I need, tablet and my hard drive and whatnot. So it's in a container, looks cute, and yet it's easily accessible. And then this little guy, it comes with this lid here, but I have my pens and stuff in it. Um, but it was from the Target dollar spot here just this spring. And so I just have my pens and stuff in there for now. And this is my mic, of course, and this little marble tray. I'm probably gonna use as like a, um, a drink station or whatever, but I'm gonna keep it under there. It's just a little mar marble tray I thrifted the other day. And yeah, I figure I often have coffee or something in here so I can set it on there and not ruin um, the top. And then of course my laptop and in this basket down here, it's really cute. I may move it somewhere else yet, but for now it's just staying right here. I got it from Hobby Lobby, so if you're curious, then I have my planner and that's pretty much it. And as far as the curtains, don't mind these. I have not hemmed them yet. I just um, hung them up the other day. I didn't iron them or anything, but I got them at TJ Maxx a while back and they just have like the little pom-pom edge um, trim on it. So I'm sure a lot of you have seen these because they've carried them for a while. This is just my little corner and I am really, really enjoying it. So I hope you all enjoyed it and this gives you a little bit of inspiration if you're needing some. And yeah, thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.